What's up, everybody? The Rhyme Man here, coming to you slightly sick, but playing more Dragon Age 2. This might have just been a transition or actually a new video. However, it doesn't matter. It probably kind of does. It doesn't matter. Alright, so we never leveled up these three, so we're going to do that right here. We're going to increase her strength. Her cunning is good. Like, she was able to last throughout such adversity. That I don't feel I need to raise her cunning necessarily. Maybe her constitution. Now, what were some abilities that she was really good with? I'm kind of torn here. Her tactics are set up. Uh, it would be so hard to get proper tactics set up. But alas, I will set it up so she has a defend a defense against uh, elements, and we will switch over her tactics so. She's a defender. Self, any reason, activate mode, might. Actually, you know what? Let's stick with this. And if she is the target... Okay, not all enemies, but if she's targeted in general. Using magic attacks, we'll have her activate the mode of elemental Igus. But afterwards, if there's enemies who... If there's no enemies at all... She'll deactivate Elemental, I guess. There we go. That'd be good, Governor. Booster cutting up. God forbid. Anders, you really need the survivability rate. Hopefully that will help him live more often than not. If not, that will be very, very sad. Let's make his heroic aura a bit better, because he has used that a number of times. And for you... Cunning, Constitution, and Dexterity. He uses this ability very often. Improves uh, Bianca. Okay, so we only have one main pot of plot quests. We have a little secondary quest to visit Gamlin, and we still have the premium content, which I'm thinking we'll do uh, very shortly. It seems like every time we get to a point of no return, the game will warn us to do whatever we need to do first, so I might wait until the very last possible second before I jump into the Legacy DLC. That way I don't get overwhelmed by the difficulty curve. It's just an idea, though. Now, let's see. Tarbus. Hubert needs help again. The Knight Commander's mad. I wish you really were the Viking. The Viscount had no heir. Will you take his place, champion? I've got a daughter champion? in the circle. There's a lot of mages in the city who aren't blood mages. Oh wow, most of them are actually on our side. Why are you still here, Viscount, Barrick? Champion? Starkhaven's too pretentious for me, and Cumberland's too boring. You always say you hate commitment, but here you are, six years later, still at Hawk's side. Dabbling. I thought you'd have noticed by now. I lie a lot. 
So it really has been another three year time skip, so it's been a total of six years in this game. Many Kanari fell in Kirkwall when we departed. I am sent to gather their swords. If you find a Kanari sword, return it to me. Just their weapons. Don't you want their bodies too? Their husks serve no purpose. The weapons shall satisfy a demand of the Kune. At this point, she's mellowed out quite a bit, so her hatred of the Canari for what they've did is still there, but... Eh. I'll keep an eye out. You will find me here. She's mellowed out considerably. Well, at least the place is well repaired now. After Meredith such a crazy ass segment. And look at what she's done. She believes she's right. It will never change. Kirkwall chafes under Meredith's control, and her first instinct is to tighten her fist. Something's going to give. And when it does. Wow, a lot of people don't like her at all. Ah, the champion of Kirkwall. Your reputation precedes you. Forgive me. I should introduce myself properly. My name is Nancio Caldera Lanos. I am a noble from the beautiful country of Antiva. And I knew right away when I heard that accent he was from Antiva. Is there something I can help you with? I've come to you in search of aid. An elven assassin I have been chasing is loose in the area. Oh yeah? Unfortunately, he's hidden himself among the local Dalish, no doubt playing on their shared heritage. He's a master manipulator who will endanger even his own kind to ensure his survival. Why would a noble hunt him? You don't seem the type to hunt assassins. Why are you after him? At first, it was merely a duty to Antiva. But after losing so many good men to him, it became personal. He's nothing but a murderer, a thief, and a liar. Smart move. Your assassin is no fool. I doubt the Dalish would hand a fellow elf over to you, murderer or no. Ah, so you see my problem. Where that elf goes, death follows. He must be captured quickly. I've heard of your dealings with the Dalish. I was hoping you could go where my men could not. Find out where the assassin is hiding, and apprehend him. Sounds, sounds like a big deal. Do you have a name, though? I'll see what I can do. One of the Dalish, a woman named Variel, is a friend of his. I suggest speaking with her first. We won't be here when you get back. We got a campsite outside the city. Look for us there. A murder of crows. Famed elven assassin from Antiva. Famed, assa famed assassin. Could it be Zevrin? Eh, I don't know. We haven't really gotten, like, too many cameos from the first thing. We haven't even seen Alistair, Liliana, like, bes apart so from the DLC. Three Templars walk into a tavern. Not right now, Varric. You feeling all right, Blondie? You're always in the mood for Templar jokes. Hmm. Something's off with him. Was this here before? Over here. Sir Marlene Selbrecht. You were courageous to speak openly against the Knight Commander. Your words did not fall on deaf ears. Several nobles are discussing, quietly, what to do about Meredith. I cannot tarry here for risk of Templar spies. If you would make common cause with us, read this. I could use all the allies I can get. Secrecy is paramount. I'll communicate by messenger if the need arises. Make her look after you, Hawk. And our fragile endeavor. Yeah, she's definitely standing with the mages, because she feels like... Just like a bunch of the other nobles, Meredith is just making things worse before they get better. Young upstart nobles back at the Rose. Drunk? Hey, Hubert. Catastrophe has struck, partner. We are ruined. Ruined! Calm yourself, my brother. Don't panic. Tell me what happened. A guard came back from the boon pit, half-wrecked, with a dozen mangled bodies. 
The horse pulling the cart was the only survivor, and it does not speak. Town full of rotten mages, and not one can get answers from a horse. I'll go. I'll see what's going on. Until then, try to stay calm. I knew I could depend on you. Just like old times, partner. You have an issue with, like, trusting people in general, but... Eh. A lot of people are like that. Buy the damn health potions, please. Lyrium potions I am fine with. Like, I am, like, above and beyond the amount of Lyrium potions I actually need. Alright, so all that. I've already checked all the armor, so... So those... <laughs> oh god, look at all this. I can get rid of that one. I don't have Isabella anymore, so I guess I'll sell that. I can't believe I permanently lost a party member. That's... It's grody. It sucks, really. 28... I'd rather go with the brothers N and Tom Cos is. Ooh, but then this comes around and that's impressive. Alright, sell that. Sell, sell, sell. Mmm, hold on to for now. Hold on to for now. Sell, sell, sell. Uh, what about you? Do you have any weapons worth looking at? 35 sovereigns! Holy shit. I mean, it does... It does notably better than, um... The... Sataref, but... Um... I'm not sure. What about you? Do you have do you have any armor Jack. that's for my companions? Damn, I was hoping. Yeah. Alright, let's go with the limb taker. YOLO. Give her that. And Sataref, I will pass on. Wait. It's a two handed weapon. Oh. Oh, god damn it. I pulled a stupid. That's humiliating. Had a perfectly good weapon. Perfectly good. <sighs> so I just demoted m the usefulness of my own weapon. Freaking wonderful. Glad, gl glad I'm smart. Glad I'm smart. I have a lot of missions I can do. Let's go to Merrill's first. Come on, Daisy. You've been holed up in here for days. If you don't get some sunshine, you'll wilt. I'm not a plant, Beric. I'm fine. Just take a walk around the low town market. Get some air, and I'll stop bothering you. I know you mean well, but I have too much to do right now. I'll let you talk some sense into her, Hawk. Her obsession. I went through a lot of trouble to get you what you Beric wanted. Beric is very sweet. 
frequently infuriating and a terrible busybody, but sweet. Were you looking for me? Nothing's wrong, is it? Not yet. I'm sure something is wrong somewhere in Kirkwall. But right now, it can wait. And I'm being a poor host, as usual. In the market the other day, out of the corner of my eye, I thought I saw Tamlin. I blinked, and he was gone. I don't know what it meant. Maybe nothing. Maybe I'm going mad. I miss them all. Even the Keeper. They probably miss you, too. I mean... They did. The keeper did say you could always come back. I'm sure the keeper would like to see you again. I'm sure she would. She loves to lecture. I bet her new first appreciates that. I wish I could have seen it. It doesn't matter. I'm here now. Maybe Varric was right. Shall we go out for a bit? I could use some sunshine. Does Meryl want to talk anymore? Doesn't look like it. Elganon, six years in this place and I still can't fix the holes in the roof. Elganon. Elganon. I can't believe Isabella is gone too. That makes things a little bit more narrow when it comes to rogues. And she was the only one who could use daggers too. Take you out. Alright, I have already used Anders, Varric, and Aveline. Let's go with Fenris, Meryl, and Sebastian. I still can't access Bethany either. These three have level ups, so. Boost up his cunning, his strength. Actually, his strength is fine. Go with willpower. Instantly restoring the warrior's stamina. That would be useful. Deep reserves. Yeah, let's go with deep reserves. Meryl's the one I use the least because she doesn't have any healing spells. Which blows significantly. Mm. There we go. Two ability points. I wish she had the creation skill, but, you know, gotta work with it. Turns the land against her foes, inflicting damage against nearby enemies as long as she sustains a spell. 46 nature damage every 4 seconds, diameter 6 meters. Finally gonna upgrade the, into that. And snare. Let's go with Ensnare. And let's see how her tactics look afterwards. Alright, let's go with Debilitator. And I want to... Let's see. I want to add something for her aggressive spells. So, enemy, enemy clustered at least three. Use ability fireball. Enemy clustered with at least five. Use ability firestorm. I also want you to be ready, just in case you're being attacked. If you're surrounded by two enemies, I want you to use uh, Fireball. There we go. There we go, there we go. He 
He couldn't take a hit to save his life, if I remember. Ooh, three ability points. 100% for flanking attacks. Now draws power from the effects of Righteous Chain, further decreases enemy damage resistance. Make the Archer's Lance ability even better. And then for this, let's go with... Subtleties, so he's less of a threat to people. There you go. And there you... Where you don't go, actually. Hmm. Oh. Mm hmm. Okay. So I am going to use Sebastian for a little while because I haven't used him in a long time. Um, so this is my balanced team of two warriors, a mage, and a rogue. Because let's face it, I'm in love with Varric, but he kind of needs a break every now and then. So I have a lot of companion quests that I can do. First, I want to go to the Hawk Estate. A time when you realize your mother isn't going to be here anymore. That ruckus has been going on for some time. Can you calm him down? What the? Oh, Anders is right here. Which is awesome. That means he stays with me very often. Alright, put away his longbow. Alright, I need some crow venom. And two of those. Ah, oh, no wonder. First off, eight sovereigns, that's big. But I've never found ambrosia. That's zero out of one. So apparently it's a really rare resource that I'm going to have to hope that I run into at some point. Ah, bummer. Meredith Aluni. Who sent this? <laughs> Fenris said Daenerys left this at the mansion. Alright, we will be doing Memento of Legacy um, soon. As I said, though, we'll save it for later. Things have been very troubling these last few years, haven't they? No kidding. I, uh, I was thinking that it might soon be time for my boy and I to move on. Where would you go? I guess the concern about the Templars is weighing on him because his son's an enchanter. Back to the merchant's life, I suppose? It's an honor to serve the champion of Kirkwall. Make no mistake, but I'm getting older. It's time to see the Sandals' future. 
I'll stay on until arrangements are made. I hope that's all right. Can I come along? I could help Sandal. If you're worried about Sandal, I can help him out. Oh, well, that's mighty kind of you, but it's unnecessary. My boy's been offered a position in Orlais. It seems the Empress herself found one of his enchantments and is intrigued. Can you imagine? Us in the Imperial Court. It sounds dangerous, though. It's Orlais. Full of assassins and stuff and dangerous people. Hopefully this business with the Templars doesn't get worse before we go. I worry about you, Miss Air. You've... You've looked after the hero for Elden, and now you've looked after me. You two are very worthwhile, amazing people. The old lady is scary. There is no old lady, Sandal. How many times do I have to tell you that? What's this about? Oh, my boy sees things sometimes. Says he saw an old lady standing by his bed. She has a scary laugh. Yes, well, there you go. Isn't this something to be concerned about? And of course we get the long segment of him scratching his ass. <laughs> oh, don't ever change, Sandal. I can make it for you. Let's check the writing. Oh, shit, look at this. Champion, I require your assistance in a matter of great urgency. Please report to the Templar Hall and the gallows at your earliest convenience. Not sure if I'm interested, to be honest. Missy Hawk, maybe you don't remember me. We met briefly and thought it was the most important moment of my life. You've changed so many lives that you probably can't keep them all straight. You rescued me from Sir Ulrich and you told me to leave Kirkwall. I wanted to tell you that I have. I won't say where I am now, but I'm free and I'm not looking back. I've heard the rumors. Terrible days are coming. I pray for the safety of my family and all the souls in Kirkwall, and especially for you. Sincerely, Ella. Ooh, my, my memory is a little bit short right now. I don't remember. <laughs> Lending house of blah, blah, blah. I can take you through a process of Morgan Senior. Shut up. Oh, Orsino. Deserve your new title despite what Meredith might prefer. You and I both know what would happen had you not been there to face the Canary. I'm sure you've received no shortage of accolades. I'm sending a gift from the Circle of Magi. Use it well. Ah, thanks, Orsino. Sister Ariel, Lord Harriman might have done to me. Surely the Maker sent you to shrine his light on that madhouse. When I left and walked into the sun, it was like walking from a nightmare. Don't know how we endured it. That place was a spider's web, and we were the flies. I'm a sister now, and I take my vows next month. They've given me a chance to pay back the good fortune you gave me, and they even taught me to read and write. Me, the daughter of a washerwoman... Hmm. Ooh, Aquatarian robes. Which I can't even wear because it requires a magic stat that's beyond me. <laughs> Why do they give me magic armor when I can't wear the magic armor? I can't bring myself to change anything about Mother's room. Alright, there's something wrong with waffles. Let's talk with Anders first, though. For the Maker's sake, draw the curtains. Do you know what could happen if the Knight Commander spies catch two apostates talking? No. What? No wonder the demons found you such easy prey. Her ignorance will be what draws the Templars down on us. I have a gift for you. Here. This might set your mind at ease. What is it? This key opens the cellars below the house here. You can get in from Darktown, if you ever need a quick escape. It means more than I can say to have had a partner these past three years. It makes me believe we can do anything. Mm, she isn't like the most lustful person. I'll always be here for you. 
I love you. There will be war soon. The mages left in Kirkwall are at the breaking point. I wish I could promise to keep you safe. Anders was given the key to get into the Hawk estate. Our cause is nearly lost. Our cause is nearly lost. It's not like she's incredibly lustful, so I decided to pass on doing things with... <laughs> Easy boy. What is it? Something in the wardrobe? All right, let's see. Please don't open the door. You've caught a burglar. Good boy. My legs are cramping. Please, just let me go. You expect me to just let you walk out of here? Please, sir. I was seduced by a crime at a very young age. But your guard monster has scared me towards a path of honest work. Yeah, I believe that. It's the dungeons for you. Go fetch a watchman, boy. Go in to fetch the watch. Dogs aren't that smart. Right? Smarter than you, anyway. Good shit. Can't, I can't believe we just had a, a burglar, like, hidden inside our wardrobe department. <laughs> Good boy, it was a good wheel of waffles. <laughs>